Jets. Street Stocks coming out onto the track, and it's Vinny Stanton on the pole in the 41, and the 71 of Howie Bott. Next row on the inside, it's the Cowboy Bill Halstead in the five car. Gary Van Orden picked up the feature win first time out on the ninth in the 54, Shady Hill. Last week's feature winner, Jimmy Anzalone's in the 31. And folks, we're going to send them by around one more time before they go green, so give them a wave as they go by. You're bet the Motor Speedway Street Stock Division. Give them a big wave. Rounding out the lineup, Tom Jones is in the 61. Then in the 7, there's Joe Graff and the 19 of George Zeniger. Let me see everybody coming out, filling the seats. Tiffany down there in front of the red section with the 50-50. And they're seeing green right now. Green flag out and we're underway. Vinny Stanton leads him down into one and two. That's how we've out on the bot on the outside. Hanging on the second, but look out, here comes the Cowboy, Bill Halston, they've been working on that car, Jimmy Angelone diving in underneath the Gary Van Order, they put on a great show for his last Saturday night, battling for the lead. Right now, Angelone moving into third as he gets uh, to the inside of Howie Bond, now dives in underneath, Bill Halstead, we'll see if he can hang in there, no, Halstead hang gets back out in front as they come off of turn number four. A little bit of contact as they race down the front stretch. All bunched up now as they hit down the back stretch. Anzalone on the inside, Halstead on the outside. Vinny Stanton still leading the way, trying to hang on as the battle continues behind him. Gary Van Orden looking for some racing room on the outside, can't find it yet. Tom Jones keeping him at bay. Jones right now in fifth in the 61. Halstead now out in front of Vinnie Stanton. As Stanton tries to hang out, but Halstead now takes the lead. Stanton down back to second. Now as they hit down into three and four. Howie Bott on the outside now trying to make some room. Coming off a of turn number four. Hands alone and Van Orden side by side trying to work their way through traffic. And yes, started handicapping the starts this week. Drivers with the lower point average of the past couple weeks all are up front. A little bit more work for the guys who have been leading the way to work their way through some traffic. A little bit of equalization there. Meanwhile, Bill Halstead starting to pull away as Anzalone and Van Orden battle through traffic. Jimmy Anzalone, though, may have found an opening coming off of turn number four to the outside, but gets a little bit loose. Coming off of turn number two, trying to hang on. Gary Van Orden now looking for some room. He may have it as well. They go through three and four. And Bill Halstead, though, taking full advantage, getting away. Anzalone trying to get by Vinny Stanton. Gets tangled up a bit. Stanton hanging on to second. But Anzalone with the position on the outside, going through three and four. Here they come off of turn number four. And the battle for second continues. Gary Van Orden just settling back in behind to see how things shake out in front of him. And it looks like a little bit of trouble for the 61 of Tom Jones slowing on the backstretch as the leader approaches. Still no caution. He's going to get off the track. I think we're okay as Bill Halstead heads down the front stretch with the lead. Antelope now in second. Van Orden is clear in third now. We'll see if they can catch the leader, Bill Halstead. Do they have enough time? Gone past the halfway point. Looks like a repeat of the uh, battle for the lead, but right now it's a battle for second. Jimmy Antelope and Gary Van Orden. They might do better just lining up and trying to reel in the leader, Bill Halstead. Van Orden though, looking inside of Anzalone, couldn't get by him last week, he's gonna do it now though. Gary Van Orden inside, Anzalone on the outside, lets him go, Gary Van Orden takes over second, but does he have enough to reel in the leader, Bill Halstead who built up a half a track length lead. And they get the five to go as Bill Halstead and the five leads them down into one and two. Gary Van Orden 
doing his best to reel him in. It's going to be tough, though. It's the last starting to count down. Angelon settling into third. Benny Stanton running fourth. Joe Graff in the seven right now in fifth. A little bit of traffic for the leader. Zeniger in the 19. Gets the move over, and Gary Van Orden is closing the gap. Does he have enough to catch him? They come off a turn number two. Zeniger getting real low to let the leaders go by. We've got a race. Two laps to go when they cross the line. Bill Halstead in the lead. Gary Van Orden closing the gap. They head down into one and two. Anzalone and Stan battling for third, but the battle for the lead. In turn number three, Gary Van Orden just a car length behind the five. They come off the four. White flag, one to go. Halstead with the lead. Van Orden making a move inside. Halstead shuts the door. They come off a two. Down the back stretch. Halstead with the lead. Gary Van Orden last catch. Dives in underneath. Halstead out in front. Van Orden gives up the room. Here they come. Off the more checkered flag. Go Halstead wins it. Gary Van Orden holds on for second. Battle for third now. Turn number three. Anzalon and Stanton. Anzalon has to go back behind Stanton. Stanton takes third. Jimmy Anzalon hangs on for fourth. And Joe Graff rounds out the top five. And Anzalone, you can see him battling the car, lost the tire as he headed down the front stretch. But folks, here he is. Let's let him hear it. Your Bethel Motors Speedway Street Stock feature winner, Cowboy Bill Halstead. I don't know why I act the way I do Like I ain't got a single thing to lose Sometimes I'm my own worst enemy I guess that's just the cowboy in me I got a life that most would love to have But sometimes I still wake up fighting me And with this road I'm heading down my lead I guess that's just the cowboy in me The urge to run, the restlessness the heart of stone I sometimes get The things I've done for foolish pride The me that's never satisfied The face that's in the mirror When I don't like what I see I guess that's just the cowboy in me Here, here he is, your Bethel Motors Speedway Street Stock feature winner Bill Halstead! Well, come on over here. I tell you, what a race. Uh, Vinny Stan was tough in the beginning. You got by him. You were able to stretch out a nice lever right at the end there, those last two laps. The guy who took home the uh, trophy the first week out, Gary Van Orden, right with you all the way. And you guys really put on a great show for us today, but nice to see you come out in front. Thank you. Uh, no, I learned, I learned it, uh, tonight earlier in the heat that uh, losing the heat to Jimmy, I, I need to hug that bottom line. So once I got out front, that bottom line was all mine. I didn't care what it took to get there. But. Well, you got it. You held it. And I tell you, it was a nice race to watch from, from start to finish. And uh, I bet you got some people sponsors you want to say thank you to. Yeah, well, the first sponsor I want to thank is uh, my ex-wife for giving me a much-deserved uh, divorce. Uh, so I can afford to play games. Uh, but, yeah, I got to thank uh, Fallsburg Lumber. Uh, NFC Plumbing and Heating, RTR Construction, B Hands Garage, Sarver Drywall. Uh, I couldn't have done this without my niece, nephew, my dad, uh, Norm Joe. Oh man, too many people, too many. I just had a, I just had a new hit put in February, and they told me let's go to racing, so just shut it up just to play around. I think you'd be here. All right, well, congratulations, you are, and let's get let them hear it again, folks. Your Bethel Motor Speedway Street Stock feature winner, the Cowboy, Bill Halstead. The urge to run the restlessness, 
the heart of stone I sometimes get The things I've done for foolish pride The me that's never satisfied The face that's in the mirror When I don't like what I see I guess that's just the cowboy in me Girl, I know there's times you must have thought There ain't a line you've drawn I haven't crossed But you set your mind to see this love on through I guess that's just the cowboy in you We ride and never worry about the fall Guess that's just the cowboy in us all start our racing program, uh, those of you that were here last week and a very good friend of our racing family here last Saturday night here, Cowboy Bill Halstead passed away suddenly and um, I know everyone here shed a tear, I know everyone here dearly misses him and we all wish he could be out here tonight so at this moment I would wish, would wish I would ask you all to please bow your head in a moment of silence in honor of uh, Cowboy Bill Halstead. Well, ladies and gentlemen, take a quick look down at the track right now. As you can see, Joe Barnes has dropped back to the second row. Jesse Hilger going to remain on the outside of row number one. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what we call the missing man formation. In honor of Cowboy Phil Halstead, the pole position will be left open for two parade laps. Gone way too early will be missed by all here at the Bethel Motor Speedway. The missing man formation. And you know, we were talking with one with, of with brothers who had not had a chance to see him racing. And he said, you know, I know him as my uncle, but I don't know, you know, what people thought. And it was, it was real nice to be able to say to him, he was a nice guy, everybody liked him. You know, just the type of guy that you meet him and you instantly like him. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to go silent for just a minute on this last lap of Missing Man Formation. In memory of Cowboy Bill Halstead, the field of pro stocks now regroups in rows of two. Well, the white flag came out and most of the field went into the pit area. What does that mean? What it means is take a peek to your left. Ladies and gentlemen, Dual checkered flags coming out in memory of Cowboy Bill Halstead. The checkered flag tonight will go to him. Stormin Norman Barnes behind the wheel of the car. Pro stock drivers all got together and decided that tonight's victory should go to Cowboy. His heart and soul went into racing here at the Bethel Motor Speedway. Last week tragically left us way too early. So in memory of Cowboy, the Pro Stock Feature event, your winner tonight will be Cowboy, Bill Halstead. The points award and the checkered flag will go to Joe Barnes. But in our hearts, in our memories, and in our minds, this win will go once again to Cowboy Bill Halstead. I am sure that the Cowboy is smiling down right now as Joe climbs out of the car. Joe. I'll tell you what, I've been here for two weeks. 
but the love for Cowboy is evident throughout the grandstands, throughout the pit area. This win tonight, I'm sure, was very sentimental for you. You worked extremely hard for this. You could tell that you wanted this one. Yeah, I normally don't run that hard, especially with Jesse, but somebody was helping me. I miss him a lot. I'm sorry, but... I don't know why I act the way I do Like I ain't got a single thing to lose Sometimes I'm my own worst enemy I guess that's just the cowboy in me I got a life that most would love to have But sometimes I still wake up fighting me And where this road I'm heading down might lead I guess that's just the cowboy in me The urge to run the restlessness the heart of stone I sometimes get The things I've done for foolish pride The me that's never satisfied The face that's in the mirror When I don't like what I see I guess that's just the cowboy in me